This is the Shark Tank, where hopeful entrepreneurs come seeking investment from the sharks. Six powerful self-made investors worth millions and billions. Can the sharks make a deal that could benefit both them and the hopeful business owners? Let's find out. And first up today is Wall Street veteran and former stockbroker turned entrepreneur Mark Hanna. Let's see if he can convince the sharks to invest in his business or if he will be eaten alive. Hey, what's up, losers? Are you serious? That was such a bad idea. <laughs> oh no. Are you crazy? You just gotta be crushing every rule in the dome right now. I'm crawling in the dome, but I want to do things bigger. I want to take this thing the next level. I love it. You don't even know what it is yet. I've revolutionized the way people write. Why don't you walk us through the numbers? The only number you need to know is zero. That's how many pens you're currently holding. Unless you're screwing with us, it makes no sense whatsoever. Mark Cuban just crapped on you. What do you say? I say hold yourself until you see what my invention can do. No emotions, no tears just reality on wall street the prices go up and down it didn't matter to me what mattered to me was bleeding americans for every penny they had and i know i can do it again with this invention oh wow fantastic this my dear sharks is pen 2.0 dutsky no, the most glorious writing instrument ever to draw God's ideas. This baby is equipped with 5G, a heart rate monitor, built-in disease scanner, a heating element, wireless phone charging, parallel parking assist, crypto mining abilities, and finally, blue ink. That's wonderful. Let's talk about money, my friend. How much have your sales been? I've sold 7,000 in three months. In three months? Roughly 90 days, yes. Wow, unbelievable. Oh, wow, fantastic. And what does it cost you to make, including the box? Well, it depends how much you are willing to pay. Do you have a patent pending, you said? I own the patents and the copyrights for everything here. Oh my God. I'm even in the process of trademarking the word Kumbaya. Don't give him the Kumbaya. I'm not giving him the Kumbaya. This is the next revolution in the carpal tunnel inducing writing. I'm gonna offer you $200,000 and I want 30% of the company. I'm gonna need more than that. And for that reason, I'm out. Fair enough. As much as I like you, I'm out. We heard you, Barbara. Oh, really? Hey, Robert, any interest? It's a trivial product. I don't think you're gonna sell many of these. I'm out. All right, all right, all right. Hang on a second. Yes. Okay, so what was your sales last year? I made more than 10 million. I'm out. Okay, well, that's... <laughs> you need a license deal. So let's think big. You need me to think big. Oh yeah, you're right. I'm never wrong, I'm always right. We can take home some cold cash via commission. Oh! And remember, there is just one Mr. Wonderful. I will make you a millionaire. I am already a millionaire. I don't really think that you need my help to do this. I'm out. I can't believe you are all going to let me walk out of here with an idea worth of trillions. Something smells a little funny here. Mm -hmm. You have a presence about you, you have the power. What I haven't been convinced is that you are an entrepreneur. I get you a breadwinner, you got those responsibilities, but I'm not convinced. <coughs> oh Lord. Come on. Come on. Mm-hmm. Oh.
One billion for three percent of my company. I'll take that offer. Done. Congratulations. Congratulations, guys. I just found this pen in the lobby. It doesn't do anything. It's a fugazi. Fugazi, fugazi. It's a wazi, it's a uzi. It's a fairy dust. It doesn't exist. It's not on the elemental chart. It is no matter. It's not real. Right?